Okay, the next thing then is to create a new sketch because what we need to do is actually create the cam follower. So I'm going to select a plane, I'm going to go for that one. I'm going to create a circle, this time I'm just going to press C for circle. And I've clicked on there, uh, dragging it out, and it's going to be 6 mil. So that's just a smidging under the 6.2, so you've got a little bit of clearance so it can slide up and down. Okay, that looks good. Um, now if I stop the sketch, I can zoom in, he says hopefully, and I'm going to create a new extrusion, and I'm looking for, ah, what's that first? Uh, no, I'm not sure which extrusion I'm on. So what I'm going to have to do is I can switch off the top. I can go down to sketches. Um, there's that sketch and that sketch. So I reckon, I remember me saying we should name all our sketches. So this is um, the hole through top. That's the hole through top sketch. And this should be the cam follower. Okay, so let's switch that one on. And now we can create our extrusion. Click on that one. We're going to do it double-sided, two sides. And I don't want to join. Um, I want it as a new component. 